Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the channel. Today, I'm gonna to go ahead and show you how to take a picture and crop it into a circle on Microsoft PowerPoint. Now, this can be used to actually crop into any shape that you would like. So, let's get into it. The first thing you're gonna go ahead and do is jump onto your PowerPoint desktop app. You can do this in the browser as well. Now, what we're gonna do is go up to the left-hand side on our ribbon and tap on insert. Okay, let us get a blank slide here and we are going to insert an image. This is the image that we would like to crop into a circle. Let's go ahead and use this beautiful BMW E30. Right, so what we want to do now is we're going to go up to insert again and we're going to look for shapes and we are going to find this circular oval shape. Now to get an exact circle, what we need to do is hold in shift and we now need to drag our mouse cursor over like this and you will now get a circle now we can click down and move the circle around all right so what we need to do is right click on the circle go down to format shape and on the right hand side you will see a few options and over here in transparency we're going to just move that transparency up to about 50 percent so that we can see the photograph behind the circle and here is where we can now potentially put this into the position that we would like okay so i want those beautiful headlights in there and i want to see those spotlights at the bottom so this is what i would like in my circle so what we can do now is click on the picture and on the top of your ribbon on the right hand side you will see picture format and picture format will give you the crop option now we're going to click on crop and here you can go ahead and you can crop your picture to where you would like your picture to be in your circle so as you can see it does give you ruler lines along with your circle that you've put in whatever shape you're using it'll do the same as you can see it turns red and we can just make sure that each one of these sides meet a point on the circle we're going to click away and you will see now that your circle is over the image that you want or the part of the image so what we're going to do now is move our circle over to the right hand side and once we've done so we can go ahead click on our image right click on the image select cut and here in our circle we are going to click on it and you will see under the fill and line option you'll get fill and line and you want to go down and look for picture or texture fill and click on that and voila there you go you've got the beautiful headlights of that bmw e30 and there you go you can now go ahead and try this with any shape that you would like if this was a helpful guide go ahead drop us a like we'll see you next time folks peace